Welcome back to Tournet Travel. In today's episode, we're diving into the stunning region of Central Asia. Home to a collection of countries known as the Stands, Central Asia is a fascinating region that is home to many different cultures and traditions. These six nations are Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan, Uzbekistan, Turkmenistan, Tajikistan and Afghanistan, all worth exploring for their unique landscapes, historic sites and delicious food. And so, if you're a fan of epic travel videos, remember to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell. First up, we have the nation of Kazakhstan, the largest country in Central Asia and is culturally and ethnically diverse, with over 130 ethnic groups and offers a diverse range of experiences for visitors. The country is famous for its steppes and deserts, which stretch as far as the eye can see. The climate is continental with cold winters and hot summers. Almaty is the country's largest city and is a great place to start your journey. The city is surrounded by mountains and has a vibrant nightlife. Another attraction is the Baikonur Cosmodrome, which is the world's first and largest operational space launch facility. The country is also home to a number of UNESCO World Heritage Sites, including the Mausoleum of Koja Ahmed Yazawi and the petroglyphs within the archaeological landscape of Tabgali. Kazakhstan is also known for its cultural traditions including traditional music, dance and cuisine. One of the notable treats is known as Bausak. These are puffy pieces of fried Kazakh bread. They're essentially Central Asian donuts. Shaped into triangles or spheres, they're usually served with tea and eaten as dessert with sugar, honey or butter. With its stunning landscapes, rich history and hospitable people, Kazakhstan is a country that should not be overlooked by intrepid travelers. Up next we have Kyrgyzstan, a small but picturesque country in Central Asia, known for its breathtaking beauty with stunning lakes, mountains and valleys. Lake Isikul is the second largest saltwater lake after the Caspian Sea and one of the largest high altitude lakes in the world and is a must visit destination. Skaska Canyon or Fairytale Canyon is a beautiful color textured canyon located on the southern shore of Isikul Lake and is one of the most interesting and frequently visited natural places in Kyrgyzstan. Kyrgyzstan gained independence from the Soviet Union in 1991 and is now a parliamentary republic. The capital city is Bishkek, which is home to over a million people and the perfect place to experience the unique blend of Soviet era and modern architecture. The economy of Kyrgyzstan is largely based on agriculture and mining, with tourism also being a growing industry with visitors drawn to the country's natural beauty and cultural heritage. The country is also known for its horse culture, with the people having a long history of horsemanship and using horses for transportation, sports and cultural events. So if you're ready for an adventure unlike any other, book your tickets to Kyrgyzstan and prepare to be amazed. Our next Central Asian nation is Uzbekistan, known for its stunning Islamic architecture and the ancient Silk Road that passed through the country. Uzbekistan was part of the Soviet Union until its independence in 1991. Since then the country has transitioned to a presidential republic. Its capital city is Tashkent, which is the largest city in Central Asia. The country is famous for its stunning Islamic architecture, showcasing intricate tilework and calligraphy. Visitors can explore the city of Samarkand, known as the Jewel of the Silk Road, which is home to many historic sites, including the Rijistan, a complex of three stunning madrasas. Bukhara is another historic city and is home to many well-preserved Islamic buildings and has been designated a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Traditional Uzbek music and dance are also an important part of the country's cultural identity as well as cuisine such as shashlik, kebabs and the national dish palov which is typically made with rice, pieces of meat, grated carrots and onions usually cooked in a kazan or degi over an open fire. In recent years the government has taken steps to promote tourism including easing visa requirements and improving infrastructure. Whether you're a history buff, an adventure seeker or simply looking for a new experience Uzbekistan is the perfect destination for you. Up next we have Turkmenistan, a country that is shrouded in mystery with strict visa regulations and limited tourism infrastructure. However, those who do manage to get into the country are rewarded with a unique cultural experience and stunning natural beauty. Its landscape is dominated by the Karakum Desert which covers about 80% of the country. The country also has fertile oases and mountain ranges along its southwestern border. 
Turkmenistan has a rich cultural heritage with evidence of human habitation dating back to the Bronze Age. Turkmenistan also gained its independence from the Soviet Union in 1991 and is also a presidential republic. Its capital city is Ashgabat, known for its modern architecture and marble-clad buildings. Visitors can also explore the ancient ruins of the city of Merv, which dates back to the 6th century BC. The economy of Turkmenistan is largely based on natural resources, particularly natural gas, which accounts for the majority of the country's exports. The natural gas industry unintentionally led to the formation of the Darvaza gas crater, also known as the door to hell, in the early 1970s. When the ground collapsed during a Soviet gas drilling expedition, scientists reportedly lit the massive hole on fire to prevent the spread of the natural gas, and it's been burning ever since, but has had plans issued in 2022 to be closed and extinguished. Turkmenistan is one of the most closed-off countries in the world and has often been criticized for human rights and political issues, as well as tight government controls over the media. Turkmenistan may be a challenging destination, but for those who take the leap and manage to get in to visit this remarkable country will be rewarded with memories that will last a lifetime. Our next Central Asian country is Tajikistan, a nation known for its rugged mountain ranges and beautiful lakes. It has a rich history with evidence of ancient human settlement and has been ruled by various empires and kingdoms throughout history. Tajikistan has a mountainous terrain with over 90% of its territory covered by mountains, making it one of the most geographically isolated countries in the world. The Pamir Mountains, also known as the Roof of the World, are located in the eastern part of the country and offer stunning natural scenery and opportunities for trekking and mountaineering. The Pamir Highway, which is the second highest highway in the world, was completed in 1932 and is a must-visit destination for adventurous travelers. Visitors can also explore the ancient Silk Road city of Korok or visit the stunning Iskanderkul Lake. The country's economy is largely based on agriculture and mining, with Tajikistan being one of the world's largest producers of aluminium. The country has a rich cultural heritage with traditional dance, music, crafts and unique cuisine. With its stunning landscapes, rich history and hospitable people, Tajikistan is a country that should not be overlooked by intrepid travelers. Our final country in our tour of Central Asia is Afghanistan, a nation with a rich history and culture that dates back thousands of years. The country's economy is predominantly agricultural, with opium poppy being a major cash crop. The country is also rich in natural resources including minerals such as copper, iron and gold. Visitors can explore the ancient ruins of the city of Balkh or visit the stunning Bandi Amir National Park, home to a series of six deep blue lakes surrounded by red sandstone cliffs. Despite years of conflict and instability, Afghanistan is still home to warm and hospitable people who are eager to share their culture with visitors. Visitors can try delicious Afghan cuisine which includes dishes like kebabs, mantu which is dumplings, or kabili palau, rice with meat and vegetables. While the security situation in Afghanistan remains challenging, visitors who take the necessary precautions can experience the country's unique beauty and culture. From the bustling markets of Kabul to the remote mountain villages, Afghanistan offers a truly unforgettable travel experience. Despite its challenges, Afghanistan remains a fascinating and rewarding destination for adventurous travelers. So, do you think you're curious and adventurous enough to visit some of these countries? Let us know in the comments. Central Asia is a diverse and fascinating region that is waiting to be explored. From the steppes of Kazakhstan to the rugged mountains of Tajikistan, each country has its own unique culture, history and natural beauty to offer. As you've seen, Central Asia definitely has something for everyone. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share this video with your friends so you can plan your next trip. Thanks for watching.